Just talking a little bit, I mean, just the second time this year you not been in a one goal game and nice for a coaching, from a coaching perspective to have a little breathing room where you can just sort of sit down and watch things. Yeah, no, it is. You almost got bored back there because usually you're juggling stuff, you're trying to match up, you're trying to do different things throughout the game and tonight it was nice just to let the guys go play and, and run all four lines. You found some offense this weekend. You worried at all about you know, some of the goals you gave up or the number of goals you gave up or it doesn't matter when you can... Well, yeah, we are and we've been tight for pretty much most of the year and you know, we know Flint, they're, they're a high scoring team. They, they, they like to get on the attack so we knew we were going to be in for one there and then, you know, tonight we don't love giving up four but it's one of those games you, you can only tell your team not to cheat for so long and then it gets gets old hat. So we tried and, and we had a great weekend. I mean, getting five or six is, is, is awesome and uh, they're believing in there already and it's great. What is it like to, to get the offense sort of rolling and you still don't, you know, know what the Johnson situation is and mm -hmm. the guys seem to have found an offensive flow? Well, we, we've seen to have found some lines here. you got to love Piersy, uh, Christopoulos and Smith. They, they've got a great mix going. They love playing together. Uh, Miedema, Abraham and AJ Spelsy. I mean, I haven't seen speed like that on a big man for a long time. And what a, what a, what a line they've seemed to form. And then obviously you got Mailer, Maggio and, and Johnny right now, Johnson. And, uh, you know, uh, I think they're, they're just getting a little bit of chemistry, getting used to each other. And Johnny hasn't played a lot of minutes, so he's, he's getting in the mix. And, and uh, you'll see some stuff from him, I think, here. And, and, and then the fourth line with Morneau, he's, I mean, Morneau, is, the, the nice comfort is to put him on the ice at any time. And usually, you know, when you're in a two minute, third period you don't want to put that fourth liner out there but with more no I just feel like he's putting the out there but the opposite hand so we got a nice thing going with Flaherty and, and McElwain and Green Tree whoever's in Martin uh, they're doing their job too. The fact that uh, you guys have won multiple different ways now so far this season uh, what does that tell you about the song? Well I, I, I think that you know we at the beginning of the year, we were trying to simplify stuff so we can be good defensively, um, and it, it would kind of work, got us through that area with, you know, Anuska playing great behind us, and and then we kind of, you know, moved to to the offense, so the offensive zone more, and I feel like we're, 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 we're we look, we feel deeper as a group, um, you know, when our D keep it simple and move pucks up, I think we're that's a big thing for us, just getting pucks up, playing at least we can in our own zone, and um, once we've been doing that, we've been pretty consistent. So I think as a group right now. It, it, there's a good mindset in there and the guys are pushing each other and it, it's great to see. Well, how are you going to prepare for the three and three? Well, yeah, I mean, obviously, uh, you know, we want to get our special teams going here. And I think, you know, uh, looking at last year, kind of a little slower to the gate. So I think we're going to have to have good special teams. Uh, we have to play North Bay here coming in. They're a good hockey team. So tr really focus on those two points before we even think about getting on the road. But uh, I think we're excited. We get on the road as a group. We have some fun. And um, uh, the guys are really rolling in there. What a start, 6-0-3. We, we, we preached a good start this year, and, and we've done it. Did that uh, game feel a little strange at all? Oh yeah, definitely. When you look, when you're wearing that jersey for a year and a half, um, it can get a little strange. But you know, I've been with these boys for a month now. I really love it here, and you know, I was just trying to play the game. Nothing too special. Were you kind of looking forward to this one though? Oh yeah, I think we all had it marked on the calendar. A couple of my buddies were texting me about it before the game on the other team. But you know, at the end of the day, you know, I play like uh, my co my old coach in minor hockey was called me before the game and just said, you know what. At the end of the day, you let let your game dictate the pace of play. You know, play for the jersey you're wearing, not the jersey that the other team's wearing. So that really stuck with me, and uh, that's what I was thinking about through the game. Anybody talk to you at all during the game, or? Oh uh, yeah, there was definitely some banter, stuff like that during the game. And then Josh Rosenzweig, panel famous, came over to me, congratulate me after the game. You know, at the end of the day, those guys, my best buddies, the guys, been with the past year and a half. But yeah, so it's just a game, you know. But uh, I was really excited to get this one with my new team, and I really love it here. And, we had a great squad. You know, a little bit of time between the two starts for you. How, how do you sort of stay sharp and, and stay focused? Uh, yeah, you just got to worry about the next puck. Um, you know, you have a couple of there, but you know, I just I just try to think. You know, when you land a goal, it could be their best. It could be their best chance on opportunity all game. You know, so I think the boys really played well for me in front of the net. Gave me a lot of good run support. You know, this was really a really good team win, and uh, they really helped me out today. I was going to say, what's it like to have a five nothing lead in your back there? Oh uh, yeah, it's 
it's definitely like it was comfortable, but at the end of the day, you just got to play like at zero zero, uh, play a full sixty minutes. Is that your first OHL assist? Uh, no, I think I had one last year, maybe two. I'm not sure, but it's always fun to see that on the stat sheet. So it was good. I mean, it's a team you find some offense this weekend. Yeah, I mean, uh, I think, uh, like I said earlier, we have uh, we have a good team this year, and I think we can do just as well as last year. I think a lot of guys are uh, stepping up and filling some roles. So uh, by the looks of it right now, I, I feel really confident in our group. Do you worry at all about some of the some of the chances you're giving up or some of the goals you're giving up to? I mean, yeah, I, I, I'm not too worried about it. I think it's something to look at and learn from, uh, and I think they're very uh, easy fixes, and I think that uh, will make us a much better team. I think this is just the second time this year you guys haven't played in a one-goal game, I and mean, what's that like to have a little bit of breathing room for a change? Yeah, it was nice. I mean, uh, I think uh, that can happen a lot more often if uh, we're all rolling and we're all playing well and we're all on the same page today. So. It was nice to kind of get some results there and, and feel really like in uh, the driver's seat. I was going to say it's what, two or three games that Mark hasn't sort of moved the lines around? Yeah, I mean, I think he's kind of found a combination that he likes. I think it's uh, pretty balanced and we got some, we got some different uh, you know, types of lines that uh, really get things done and, and are, are doing really well right now. I, I mean, third game in four days, but you guys look like you had a lot of jump out there. Yeah, I, I think we're just a very motivated group. I think everybody's excited to, to get out there and uh, play hockey. Uh, I think we're doing something special with uh, the, uh, how we're performing right now at the beginning of the season. So uh, I think everybody is just really excited and motivated. Talk a little about Joey. I mean, he's played two games. He's given up four power play goals against. He's had one on a two on none. But I mean, other than that, he's given up one goal in those time. Yeah, he's awesome, solid. I mean, uh, like you said, I don't think he's he's really letting in anything soft. I mean, a lot of like even today he saw there was a two on zero. Like he, he's been really good for us, and he he's good. He stays sharp. He knows when he has to step up, and he's been doing that really well for us. Have you guys talked about the point streak at all to start the season? Uh, honestly, I think we're uh, we're aware, but we're not something we like kind of uh, focus on too much. I think uh, we we all know what. Uh, we're, we're getting the points, but uh, we're just trying to just trying to focus on each game one at a time. Nice to bank those early in the season, though. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Like you said, like it's uh, we're picking up points in uh, every game, so it's uh, it's really good for us. And I think, yeah, like even those overtime uh, losses will help us uh, uh, far on the season. Perfect.